Hello! Welcome to another writing lesson video for online school. I know that all of you are working hard. Thank you for all of your updates. I hope everyone's doing well, having fun, playing, and doing nice things at your house. I miss you, just like always, and I hope you'll come back to school soon. But for now, I want to continue on with our writing. So you've been doing a writing piece about how to have a good idea to fix a problem that you can see at home or school or somewhere around outside. We're going to keep working on that. Please go and fix it up as best you can. Don't need to spend too long on that. Just writing every day 10 or 15 minutes like we do at school is okay. Now, today I want to talk about how to do our writing. Remember, at school, sometimes boys and girls come and ask how to write something. And I will help, but I don't tell you exactly what the letters are in the word. I give you some ways that you can find out by yourself. Now, at home, mommy and daddy, or grandma and grandpa, big brother, big sister, they might be helping you to know how to write the words perfectly. That's okay. We need to know that eventually. But in kindergarten, I'm going to remind you how we do it at school so that you can practice and you don't always have to be saying, how do you spell? How do you spell? How do you spell? Because remember, we don't want to be always asking, how do you spell? So first, remember, my first suggestion when you come to me is do like Stretchy the Snake and stretch out the sounds. Listen carefully and stretch them out. For example, if you want to spell the word, mm, let's pick an easy one, dog. If I wanted to write dog and I don't know, I would check my sounds. D, 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 that's a D. Ah, 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 that's an O. G, 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 that's a G. Put them together. D, og, dog. You can do that with any word. When it gets longer, it can be hard, but you can try your best. When you are at school, we always also check the word wall. For the words you know by sight, the, and, on, in, things like that. If you're not sure, that's okay. Always take a look at the word wall and check. Those ones we definitely want to write the right way. Or you can also listen for chunks and use our chunky monkey strategy all the time too. You can listen for chunks like the word into. It actually has two smaller words, in, to. That makes it easier. And when we're at school, I want you to look around the classroom. Sometimes I write things on the board for how to start your sentence. Then please use that. You don't need to guess. doesn't need to be slow. Just go real fast and write it down. Or did you see the same word somewhere else? Look around the classroom, look anywhere you can to find out how to write the word. And just like our song, our vowel sound hound dog song, don't forget our five vowels, A, E, I, O, U, O, A, E, I, O, U. Every word has one of those in it. So if I wanted to write the word car, and I wrote k k k c r r r r just c r the sounds are right but there's no vowel I definitely need one of them in there c in this case a r car I know it's tricky it's tough to hear English is tough for spelling I'm so sorry do your best but these are five good ways to help you know how to write a word if you're not sure, there's other things you can do. And of course, you can also check with other people. When we get back to school, I still won't tell you exactly how to write it, but I'll help you find one of these ways to do your best for writing it so everyone can read it. Keep writing. Do your best. Good job, everyone. I'm proud of you.